Yo, it's Laser, and today we're going to be learning how to get uh, Fraps, the latest version 3.5.9, for free. And if we have time, we'll have time, we're going to go over uh, settings. You know, the best settings for uh, gamers whenever they record. And so let's just go ahead and get right into it. First, you're going to have to go to this link right here. I'm going to leave it in the description, gamefront.com. Just click download now, the big orange thing. It's going to bring up a little box to the right any day now. Okay. And so it's going to say save file. Um, I don't know if any of you have Express Zip. Some of you might if you do a lot of cracking or extracting. But uh, you want to open this up in a WinRAR if you have it. Uh, if you don't, you can just go and download it off of um, Google. Uh, it's not free, but I mean, you can get. I mean, you can get it a free trial for free and use it like virtually forever. I'm sure it might work in Express Zip too, but for the sake of doing everything religiously, you know, to how I learned how to do it, we'll just use a WinRAR archiver. So we're gonna open it up in that and do that. We'll just minimize this. And so, uh, WinRAR is not free. It's not a free thing. Uh, you know, don't worry about that. Just click close if that even pops up. Select the folder here and select extract. Uh, now I'm going to extract it to my desktop. That's what you want to do too, unless you want to go on and dig for it. It's fine. I mean, it doesn't matter where you extract it to. But uh, I, I extracted it to my desktop. As you can see here, this is where my original folder was when I, whenever I did it. Uh, if I if I, if I try to uh, extract it, it'll say the following file already exists, uh, as you can see here. So that's legit. Just exit out. I mean, well, of course, you extract it, you know, let it do its extracting process and everything. So, after you've done all of that, you can exit out of that or minimize it and select this and select the setup. Double click that and go through the entire setup. It's pretty self explanatory. Um, don't really change anything. I mean, it even puts a uh, shortcut onto your desktop for you. So, once we're done with that, um, the, you'll have fraps. And it'll be licensed to Shaggy Do, whoever the hell that is. And this is uh, what Fraps looks like. Fraps is the best, and there's nothing better than Fraps as far as screen recording. I downloaded one earlier today, and it was horrible. I mean, you know, you just can't get quality stuff, you know, for you know, free. That's why we, you know, crack this. So anyway, um, so if you want to record your screen, if you're not just trying to record games. Uh, you have to select the monitor arrow desktop thing none of this stuff really matters and everything so you can leave that alone unless you really want to select that stuff or whatever you're doing and so here um, here is everything else that you're gonna need here you're not gonna need this um, unless you want to use it but uh, this is really important right here um, this is where your overlay is so you can select uh, right now I have mine on hide overlay this is the FPS counter so like I can select here and like you can see it up in the corner right here or I can select here and it's in the corner over there you know you really don't want people seeing that usually uh, a lot of times you can just have the counter like down here below I don't know if it's recording that anyway but it's down here below that's the best uh, place to have it right there you really don't need it if you're recording your screen anyway to be up there uh, if you're recording games it's a different story um, you might just know where it is uh, you know just sometimes it, it's a little hard tough to know if you're recording or not you know I can understand that so uh, movies this is the most important p place make sure you're saving your movies into your videos file or into a special format a uh, uh, special folder that you've made don't save it into like default will be C colon slash fraps you don't want it to save it into your fraps folder because I mean you, you'll be you'll go crazy trying to find that stuff just have it saved to your videos it'll save in the AVI format usually if you're uh, if you're recording your screen so uh, you know you'll be able to find this stuff easily uh, video capture hot hotkey this is what you press 
in order to uh, get the thing to start recording. And so uh, make it make it off the wall. Make it like Shift Z or like F11 or something like that. Um, the default's F10. That's a good one. Don't make it Space Bar or the R button or the W button or the X button or anything you're going to be using during gaming. Because if you just if you slightly brush up against any one of those and hit the key on accident, then your recording is gone. Uh, you might lose valuable seconds in between the recording before you realize what you've done. So. Uh, it'll stop recording immediately. So make it Shift Z or something like that. I use Shift Z. I, I, I think that's a, a you know. Or occasionally I use Shift T uh, or Shift yeah Shift S for start maybe. And so uh, start and stop. So anyway, uh, video capture settings. Uh, the best if you have a like a if your computer is like a boss. You can select the 60 frames per second. That's what uh, HTPVR and Elgato use to record off of uh, TV screens. Um, but YouTube, uh, everybody knows this anyway, but I got to say it because it's a tutorial. YouTube only records, um, it only picks up 30 frames per second, and more specifically, 29.97 frames per second. And so you're just better off selecting 30 frames per second if you don't plan on going hardcore because uh, 60 frames per second, all it's going to do is lower your quality down to 30 frames per second, and um, you're going to be pretty pissed. If you want the best quality, uh, select full size. If you're just chilling, uh, select half size. I don't know why I have full size on there because I'm just recording my screen right now. But yeah, none of this stuff really matters here. Um, all right, so, oh, I think I forgot one thing. No, all right, so. Um, sound capture uh, capture settings. Record uh, Windows Seven sound. I have Windows Seven, so it's gonna say Windows Seven sound. If you have like Windows Vista or perhaps Windows uh, Eight, that's gonna be different from you for you, I think. But it's this is basically record the computer sound. So you know, um, uh, it, it's recording. It's recording. Like if I if I were to make like a a sound on my computer that that's that's picking up on that that would pick up on the uh on the thing so if you're just recording yourself uh, your your yourself and your your games and everything just click stereo that's going to record your your system you know if you're, you're on a Skype channel or something like that, click multi-channel so you can pick up the sounds from different places and everything, your friends or, or whatnot. Um, if you want to record with a mic like I'm doing right now, uh, just select the record external input. This will uh, record any mic that you just stick into your um, into your computer via USB. So, uh, you know, our, our other way, like, you know, like a, like a jack. And so uh, you can see I'm using microphone blue snowball. Uh, I can't click anything like this right now because since I'm recording with Fraps right now, um, don't do this. This is stupid right here. If you want to hide your mouse, you can select hide mouse cursor in video. And a lot good YouTubers lock their frame rate while recording. I don't have to do that right now since I'm uh, my frame rate is not going to exceed you know 30 while I'm doing this. But good YouTubers usually lock their frame rate while they are recording. You don't have to click any of this because I don't know what the hell that is. Uh, if you want, you can do screenshots on here. You can do any kind of screenshot that you want, and you can set your own screenshot hotkey. And so, guys, that's, just, that's basically how you get um, fraps for free. And those are the most, those are the best settings for actually recording with the software. If you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe, and please share. And I will love you guys. Peace out.